hello and welcome back to my channel and in this video I've had a little break and now it's time to give my hamsters a little break so I'm going to be doing um, a new hamster cage theme when I get back inspired by the cabin in the woods and um, yeah so um, that's what I'm going to be doing with the hamsters so I hope you really do enjoy this video um, watch and see the cabin in the woods and what I've created for both Ro Rosie yes and Kubo in this video so I'm just gonna go back to my cabin in the woods so <laughs> Amazon and um, I just wanted to share this box opening quickly with you because it's going to help me do the cage because the things that I need are in this box okay so what I need is this care fresh and whether you can see it in the, the lighting there but it's kind of like this kind of browny color um, so this is the kind of look that I was going for because the kind of look that I'm going for with this theme is like a cabin in the woods. So I've got this care fresh and together with the chip wood as well, which I will add. I've also got some of the um, sand here. So for the sand bath, so just a new one of those has come through today. That's all that's in the box in that box anyway but the um the stuff that i really wanted to show you is in this smaller box here so let's get a close-up of that let's open this up i'm so excited um, to show you i've bought this product similar to this not this particular one but one similar to this um, in the past it's all coming up compact and I suppose I'm going to have to fix this up in order to get it into the cage. So, there we go. And if you want to have a quick look at how that looks. So this, this is what I'm excited about. So it's going to be the cabin in the woods. And this is the wooden hamster playground. And yep, it's suitable for... Um, hamsters and gerbils and mice and it's also made of natural wood um, so yes so this is great it offers them the house as well a quiet place for them to relax and isn't that what a, um, a cabin in the woods does when we go on holiday um, it's just a nice place for you to relax and it also comes with the ladders as well for them to climb as you can see on here I'm not even focused in there we go for them to climb up yep and the sizes of this is approximately which you need to be aware of if, if in case you're going to purchase one of these um approximately sizes 47 by 22 by 15 centimeters so yeah i'm going to have to fix that up Okay, so here are the bits and this is like the ladder and obviously it can, oh that's quite good because it's got the flexibility and it can bend. I have seen these before but I've never actually had one before. So these are the ladders and I'm sure with these we'll see where they slot in as always. And then we've got this little round tunnel which is looking really um, exciting, um, can't wait to see um, them go through there. So that's going to be good. And I'm loving all this um, natural, the, the natural woods. That's what I like about it. And maybe you can see that picture a bit more close up now. There. So, anyway, and then we have this part here. So, this is very rustic, very rustic looking. So let's see how we have to do this. I've never done one of these before. 
and I can see that at the front of the house we can see there are two um, two little holes here and I'm assuming that's where the bridge will go through so I'm going to slot in the first bridge in here you can see that how I'm doing that I don't know whether you can the lighting's not very good I'm going to turn my camera around just slightly that's better just because um it's hard to um right there we go so that's going to go like this i think that's the going to be the front of it so okay this big circle um this goes in here as you can see, the part here, the tunnel, has been put here and there's a little circle here where it slots into and this is another place where they can sleep and then another hideout here and another hideout at the top here and also we can do something with the um, part here, maybe some food, maybe water, we'll think about what we can do there but we do have two more ladders and one of those ladders is on the top here. So. We'll slot it in there and I think that can, I don't know if that can come all the way down. And you can see there's two more holes, very hard to see, but and there, there's another little a bridge. So this is what it will look like. And again, if we look at the picture, this is what it looks like. So before I begin, as I was saying, I'm going to be clearing out the cage. I'm just going to take the lid off first. So I'm just going to be giving the cage a good clean because it definitely needs a good clean, as any hamster owner knows um, how messy cages can get. I'm time lapsing that for you so you can see that process. And then we will go on with creating this cabin in the woods, which I'm really excited about. So I'm just gonna get my gloves on and we're gonna make a start. from the video I just cleaned out the hamster cage and now I'm going to be putting in all the necessary items into the cage including the cabin so their little wood house um, so yes so keep watching cabin in the woods theme for them I've tried to create that theme with all the colors and the wood chips and I think it has a really good effect so I have done another video about this item and it is the self feeding um, item um, product that I purchased it was in one of my videos on the shopping haul if you haven't checked that video out I'm going to be placing this in here so it will give them the incentive to climb up and just be a little bit adventurous. I'll probably move it around, but that will be the feeding. I will update you on how good that is because I did say I would um, let you know. Um, also in the corner, the changes I've done is there is the sand bath now over here. We have the water feeder over here so that they can get their wa water and also um, the wheel, exercise wheel. I also um, from one of the um, I forgot what it was called the assault course if you haven't checked that video out go and check that one out as well the assault course um, product I have just taken this um, part of the tunnel part out where they can e even get out of these little circles here and I thought that would be a good touch because again it's like the cabin in the wood effect 
if you can see that and want the holes showing and also I have this um, nice gnawing um, bar here um, and that's got loads of nutrients and it's all natural foods I think again that's probably a rosewood one that I purchased and it looks like it's got pieces of lavender in there so I'm going to be placing that in here as well yeah we do need our hamsters to demonstrate and show us how good this cabin in the woods really is so introducing Rosie and Kubo let's get them in there and let's see how it goes so introducing Kubo into the cabin in the wood he's exercising and while he's busy with that introducing Rosie into the cage so there's Rosie So I do hope that you enjoyed that video and um, if you did, please give it a like. Um, don't forget to subscribe and make any comments down below. Um, and it was really um, enjoyable for me making that video as well and seeing the hamsters really happy and in their cabin in the woods. So I'm just going to go off and enjoy my little break now. So bye for now and hope to see you again in my next video.